DIY for. So I've got another New Year's themed DIY for you leading up to the holiday. Next week we'll be into 2018 and uh, why not ring in the New Year's with some fancy wine glasses. Now I've done a couple of wine glass tutorials in the past. I will leave those linked down below if you want to check them out as well. They seem to be very popular so I thought I would do some New Year's themed glasses. Uh, one's permanent and the other one is completely removable so it won't wreck any of your glasses that you might already own. So you're going to need your glasses, a hot glue gun, scissors, some black felt, a black stretchy elastic, and then I'm also using a glass paint marker for the first time. So first off, it's the bow tie, which is a removable option. Um, we have two rectangles, one very large, one small. You pinch the large one together and that is your bow tie, and then the little piece just kind of covers that up. So I hot glued the little center there. It makes the next step a little easier, where you're gluing that piece uh, across the top of it and glue it in at the back to hide that. Next we have the black elastic that I am just adding and uh, make sure it's about the same size as your glass. It'll fit snugly on there. So you glue that onto the back and then it wraps around your glass just like that. The other option was with the glass paintbrush marker. Now I've never used one of these before. I thought I'd test it out. Previously I've used just all-purpose paint and a paintbrush. I thought this might be better because of the application wasn't great. Uh, you can wipe it off because you bake it on. So you can wipe it off until you like it, until you bake it in the oven. Uh, I didn't really like anything except for this little bottom piece that I did here. I found that the marker had really poor application. It didn't look good. It was streaky. So I went to a different option. Um, I decided last minute that plan B was to create a disco ball with some scrap material that I have, some sequins. You cut out a little rough circle, stuff it up, and then we're going to seal it in there with the needle and thread. So this is the easiest way to do it. You weave the needle and thread in and out around the circumference of the circle. Once you then uh, pull it tight, it looks something like this, and then you're going to just knot it off. Now, the way that I attached it to my glass was with a hot glue gun. Uh, that should actually come off really easily, but you could always tie it up around there as well. So if you enjoyed that video, please give me a like, and if you attempt to make any of these DIYs, I'd love to see what your wine glasses look like. Maybe not for the New Year's, maybe for an event down the road. I'd still love to see them. You can follow me on Instagram and on Twitter, at Janelle Steeper, and tag me in those photos so I can check out your DIY. Now, I will be back next Wednesday with a new video, so don't forget to subscribe. I'd love to have you on board for 2018. I've got a couple of new series ideas that are floating around in my head. I might be bringing back my Cheap Thrill series, so you'll have to find out in the new year and see. But otherwise, Happy New Year, and I will talk to you next Wednesday. Cheers.